as a banker, our job is to find the right fit, um, make it work, find the lowest possible uh, payment plan for them to make the life easier for the client. But in trying to make life easier for the client, what does a bank do? Charge interest. Yes. So the bank's making money off of somebody else's unfortunate life situation. So it's making the life easier for them with lower payments in the moment, mm -hmm. but in the long run, the bank is still making more money off that client by helping them than the client is really making or saving themselves. Yes. So um, what was happening is I worked at a good bank, um, Scotia Bank, and uh, my manager was straight, and she was like, "We don't take bad loans. We do A and B business. That's what we do." Um, and, and so it was really hard to help everybody. Uh, not everybody gives their full income. A lot yeah. of business for sale hide some incomes. And so when somebody walks through the door at a bank asking for help, I wasn't able to help everybody. Mm -hmm. That was the biggest difference. And so that must be hard on you. It, it was tough. You're, you're a person I used to take it home with me. Like, man, they walked in today. They needed that loan. I, they just didn't qualify by that much. And how do I help them? And even my dad says, you can't bring your work home with you. Right? Like, uh, you have to leave it at, at the bank. But it's like, you care. You have that caring feeling. And now selling tea, um, they walk through the door and be like, hey, I want chai. Okay. You want a milkshake? Okay. Yeah. So I can help you. You can help every need. person. I can in. help. Yeah. So there's the difference. One more thing. Remembered. To all the kids watching out there right now. To be remembered. It, it's good advice. Remember right? somebody's name. Yeah. That is the biggest thing. If you walk into a place and you've only met that person once. Yeah. And you come back there five weeks later and that person behind the counter says, oh, hey, Mike, you're back. Yeah. That is uh, what you remember me after five weeks? Well, yes. we do that here. I don't know how. You do. But we yeah. do. Instead of, hey, bro. No. <laughs> hey, sweetie, how are you? Come in. <laughs> Thanks, Steve. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's Mr. Right. Corey. <laughs> <laughs> uh, good times. But literally, it's those little gestures, man, that mean the world. It's like you going home and getting to hug Julia yeah. right before bedtime. Yeah. It's that one gesture that you might punch Johnny. <laughs> but it, you know, whatever, it's that little gesture that you get to do that nobody else gets to do that means yeah. the world. And for me, it's greeting people. I say hello in a way that you want to come back and have hello said to you again. Yes. Right? It's just like, hey! Right? It's, yeah. We do that. That's cool. I'll tell you what, we're here on a Sunday afternoon. And That's been closed, uh, crazy. Yeah. And people are stopping, looking at the door, walking away. The signs are off. There's no chairs outside. There's no umbrella outside. There's, But... Um, it's been a great response to this yeah. location. Yeah, well, and also all you guys. Congratulations. It's the word of mouth of saying Jazz is back, Sip Chai is back, and, yeah. and then Circle Square and Chilliwack promoting for us. Uh, the Abbey News did a big promo in February. We are open seven days a week. Um, I mean, 365 days a year. We're open on Christmas, we're open on New Year's. We're, um, it's like that third place. You know, you have your home, you're always there, and you have your work, which you're at work more than you are at home. Mm -hmm. But in between there, you need that place to kind of wind down. Yeah. And so whether you go for a beer after work and then home or you go watch the game, we want to be that third place for people. Uh, it's that cool, chill, lounge vibe. And that's what we want to be. If Whether we can do it or not, we're trying to figure that out. But well, that's I think you have purpose. done that. Yeah. So Clearbrook Road. Yes. In the Clearbrook Plaza Mall with ICBC. Mm -hmm. So the corner of town, uh, not town line, that's my old location. Uh, South Fraser Way and Clearbrook Road. So really easy. The Royal Bank Water Fountain Mall. Yes. Um, that's yeah, there's a water fountain that kids used to fill with soap every hey, couple months. Hey, he never said that. He didn't teach people that. <laughs> I didn't teach it. I said that, I, I said there's there a were kids. Uh, yeah, did it. I think yeah. there's block now. Or yeah, stuff. you can't do it now. You can't yeah. do it now. But no. But yeah, yeah. And so you're at a great location. There's lots of parking. Yeah, lots of parking. Uh, very central. Very community oriented. Um, yeah, if you guys want to reach out and see how we can help in your cause or your event, or, uh, let us know.